how to do screen replacements with the corner pin. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. First of all, let me thank you for subscribing. In the last video, I said thank you to my 70 plus subscribers and now we're 160 plus. I really appreciate it. I hope you continue subscribing. In the previous video, I showed you how to use the planar tracker and do this cool stabilization effect. And I also told you about the corner pin option. So in this video, I'll show you how you can easily replace screens in your videos. Let's get into it. We wanna go to the Fusion page. We're gonna hit shift and space bar and look for the planar tracker. We're gonna hit add. Then we'd like to make an area which we would wanna track. So first we're tracking, set a reference time, track forward, go back to the reference time by pressing on this go button and track backwards. Then we're gonna go on the operation mode and then the scroll down, we're gonna hit corner pin. We're gonna get this red square, set the points roughly where the screen is going to be connect our media in node to the green input of the planar tracker. I've chosen a picture of my puppy. Add a Delta Care node. We're gonna click on the background color, choose the green. Then on the planar tracker, on the merge mode, we are going to go on background over foreground. Let's check it in the edit page. Here's the result. And that's pretty much how you can use the corner pins in the planar tracker. It's really useful to replace screens in your videos to make your log fancier. I don't know, just if you need to use it, this is how. I would really appreciate it if you subscribe, like, share, all that good stuff, and I'll see you in the next one.